planning a family trip to Newfoundland, wondering what to do? Well, you've landed in the right place. Let's embark on an exciting virtual journey to Newfoundland, a place brimming with unique culture and breathtaking landscapes. From its rugged cliffs to rolling hills, from its vibrant cities to quaint fishing villages, Newfoundland is a treasure trove of experiences waiting to be discovered. So buckle up, as we are about to take you on a thrilling ride and unveil the top 10 things to do in Newfoundland. Kicking off our list at number 10 is visiting The Rooms. This cultural gem is Newfoundland's largest public cultural space, offering a captivating blend of history, heritage, and creative expression. As you wander through this architectural marvel, you'll find yourself immersed in a world of art, history, and natural science. The Rooms houses an extensive collection of artifacts, art, and archival records that tell the tale of the province's unique history. Here you can explore the rich tapestry of stories, traditions, and historical events that have shaped Newfoundland and its people. From the indigenous Beothuk people to the European settlers, each exhibit provides a window into the past. And of course, there's the breathtaking view of St. John's Harbor and the surrounding cityscape from the top floor. The Rooms is a treasure trove of cultural insight, making it an ideal destination for families. A perfect spot to immerse your family in Newfoundland's rich history. At number 9 we have the iconic Signal Hill. This historic landmark is a beacon of Newfoundland's past, standing tall above the city of St. John S. Signal Hill is steeped in history, having played an instrumental role in communication for centuries. It's here that the first transatlantic wireless signal was received in 1901 by Guglielmo Marconi, marking a significant milestone in human connectivity. But it's not just the history that makes Signal Hill a must-see. The hill offers a stunning panorama of St. John's cityscape, the vast Atlantic Ocean, and the rugged Newfoundland coastline. It's a sight that truly takes your breath away. Whether you're a history buff or a nature lover, Signal Hill has something to offer everyone. And if you're lucky, you might even spot an iceberg or two on the horizon. Just imagine, standing atop this historical monument, gazing out at the same view that's been enjoyed for centuries. A visit to Signal Hill is a must for any family visiting Newfoundland. Coming in at number 8, is the unforgettable experience of whale watching. There's no thrill quite like spotting a whale in the wild, and Newfoundland is one of the premier locations for this activity. The best time to embark on this adventure is during the warmer months, from May to September, when up to 22 species of whales grace the coastal waters. Marvel at the playful humpbacks as they leap from the water, or the majestic blue whales the largest creatures on Earth. You might even catch a glimpse of the rare white belugas or the striking orcas. Newfoundland's nutrient-rich waters and abundant marine life make it a favored destination for these magnificent creatures and a perfect spot for whale enthusiasts. Whether you're a seasoned whale watcher or this is your first time, the experience is sure to be magical. The sight of these gentle giants frolicking freely in their natural habitat is simply breathtaking, an experience your family will never forget. At number 7 we recommend a visit to the breathtaking Gromore National Park. Covering an expansive area of over 1800 square kilometers, this park is a haven for adventure seekers and nature lovers alike. Here, you can immerse yourself in a world of captivating natural beauty and diverse wildlife. Gromore National Park offers a plethora of activities for the whole family. Venture on a hiking trail that takes you through spellbinding landscapes, or enjoy a leisurely boat tour on the park's pristine waters. The park's diverse terrain provides ample opportunity for birdwatching and photography, ensuring a memorable experience for all. Moreover, Gromorne is not just any park. It holds the prestigious distinction of being a UNESCO World Heritage Site, thanks to its exceptional natural beauty and geological significance. It's a living testament to the planet's history and evolution. In conclusion, Gromore National Park is more than just a visit, it's a natural playground for your family to explore. Halfway through our list at number 6 is the East Coast Trail. This trail is a scenic delight, a symphony of crashing waves and whispering winds, a panorama of rugged cliffs and verdant forests. It's a place where you can feel the power of nature and the timeless bond between land and sea. The East Coast Trail is the playground of the adventurous. It's a place where families can hike together, exploring the rugged beauty of Newfoundland's coastline. You might spot a puffin or a whale, see an iceberg in the distance, or discover a hidden waterfall. The trail stretches over 200 kilometers, but don't be daunted. You can tackle small sections at a time, making it a perfect adventure for families. It's a journey of discovery, a chance to bond with nature and each other. You'll create memories that will last a lifetime. 
a true hiker's paradise right here in Newfoundland. At number 5, we have the charming Quiddy Vidi Village. Nestled on the edge of St. John S., this village is a delightful mix of old-world charm and modern amenities. Imagine a place where the picturesque views of the North Atlantic Ocean blend seamlessly with the quaint, rustic houses. It's a sight that could grace a postcard and it's all here in Quiddy Vidi Village. Now, what makes this village even more interesting is its unique brewery, Quiddy Vidi Brewery. This isn't just any brewery, it's a place where traditional brewing methods meet innovative flavors. A sip of their iceberg beer, brewed from 20 year old iceberg water, is truly a unique experience. And let's not forget the local artisans. Whether it's handcrafted pottery, intricate textiles or unique jewelry, there's something for everyone. Supporting these talented folks not only enriches your travel experience, but also contributes to the local economy. A quaint village experience your family will love. Number 4 on our list is the Cape Spear Lighthouse. This iconic spot isn't just a pretty picture, it's steeped in history and holds the unique title of being the easternmost point in North America. Imagine standing at the edge of the continent, the Atlantic Ocean stretching out before you. The original lighthouse at Cape Spear was built in the early 18th century and it served as a beacon for mariners for nearly 150 years. Today, the lighthouse has been restored to its mid-19th century appearance, offering us a window into the past. While there, wander the trails that crisscross the area, taking you through a beautiful blend of rugged coastline and delicate wildflower meadows, the panoramic views are breathtaking making every moment at Cape Spear a memory to cherish. So remember to pack your camera, a stunning spot for family photos. Coming in at number 3 is the awe-inspiring activity of iceberg viewing. Newfoundland, particularly along the north and east coasts, offers an exclusive front row seat to witness these natural wonders. Imagine standing on the shoreline in the crisp, clear air as these majestic ice sculptures float silently by. It's as if time itself has frozen, and you're in a world that's both ancient and otherworldly. The best time to view these icy behemoths is during the late spring and early summer, when they break away from the Arctic and journey southward. Each iceberg is unique, with its own shape, size and color, ranging from dazzling white to the deepest blue. This makes every iceberg viewing a unique experience. But remember, these are not just beautiful sights to behold. They're also a stark reminder of our planet's changing climate. So, let's cherish and protect these frozen giants while we can. A truly cool experience for your family, pun intended. Our runner-up at number 2 is the Johnson Geo Center. This is not your average museum. Located in the heart of St. John, yes, the Johnson Geo Center takes you deep into the Earth's crust without ever leaving the city. The center is a geological interpretation center that offers a unique experience for both kids and adults. It's a place where learning and fun go hand in hand. Here you can discover fascinating exhibits that delve into the mysteries of our planet, our solar system, and beyond. The interactive exhibits at the Geo Center bring science to life in the most engaging way. Kids can get hands-on with earth science, touching real fossils and minerals, while adults can explore the intricate workings of our planet. The center is also home to a state-of-the-art planetarium, where you can journey through the cosmos without leaving your seat. Not just a tourist spot, but a venue for enlightenment and entertainment. The Johnson Geo Center is an engaging and educational experience for the entire family. And finally, our number one thing to do in Newfoundland is to experience the local cuisine. Newfoundland's culinary scene is a treasure trove of unique dishes that reflect its rich history and culture. The province's location, surrounded by the North Atlantic, means seafood is a staple, with fresh cod, mussels, and lobster often on the menu. Indulge in a traditional jigs dinner, a hearty one-pot meal of salt beef, cabbage, turnip, and potato. Or perhaps try toutons a type of fried bread dough served with molasses or syrup. For the more adventurous, there's the Newfoundland delicacy of seal flipper pie. You'll find the best food in Newfoundland in the capital, St. John S., where a burgeoning food scene offers everything from high-end dining to cozy, family-friendly eateries. Don't forget to wash it all down with some local craft beer or a glass of screech, a type of rum popular in the province. A culinary adventure that will leave your family wanting more. And there you have it, the top 10 things to do in Newfoundland for a family visit. From the awe-inspiring views at the Rooms and Signal Hill, to the thrilling experiences of whale watching and iceberg viewing, the enchanting trails at Gromore National Park and East Coast Trail, the charm of Quiddy Vidi Village, Cape Spear Lighthouse and Johnson Geo Center, and lastly, 
the mouth-watering Newfoundland cuisine. Each one promises a unique and unforgettable experience. Pack your bags, your unforgettable Newfoundland family adventure awaits.